hi everyone so this is my last haul video for today um, it's not that I got all of these things in one go it's just that they were sitting in the boxes and I was waiting for the right time to film them but there is never a right time because sometimes there are noises sometimes there is no right light so I just thought instead of them sitting there forever um, I will make a video regardless so if there's any noise I am sorry for that okay so um, this is something I picked up from Amazon and there is one big item which is not included in, in this video simply because I need to get some paper and ink for it uh, ink cartridges to actually um, give you a full review so it's the Canon selfie um, printer photo printer so I'm really excited about that and I will like I said do a separate review so let's get on with this so to begin with I have ordered a few things from what well, two stencils from what's his name oh, Tim Holtz there we go so uh, this is a heart hearts to be precise um, stencil so they kind of uh, they have three sizes to them the smaller medium and then the big ones at right at the bottom so you can use the stencil differently you can if you only want smaller section you can sort of um, use your spatula let me just grab one so you can use your spatula and textured um, paste and use one section or you can use just a long strip and then kind of add another strip next to it to create that graduation or you can just stick to one size like I said here and there just sort of creating an interesting texture so that's one and then um, the same brand and the same designer we also have here a doily I thought that looks quite nice I don't know how it's going to work and I will let you know because it has a lot of small details as you can see so I'm not sure how the paste will go into them and it probably will be a nightmare to clean but let's see how we get on so I just realized this is also by Tim Holtz and um, so, so this this is a pa paper distressor and thread cutter so you can use it in different ways and what it is is I saw Irid Landgriff whose scrapbook videos are beautiful you have to check her channel out and I have learned a lot from her um, videos so she has used this um, gadget once and I, um, I had to ask her on Instagram what what it was because it's um, exactly what I need so what it does is if you have a, a you know straight cut edge and you want to create a little bit worn look to it and give it an interesting um, texture then you just obviously use the blades on the side here and you just run through it and that takes care of that perfectly cut edge and it creates a lovely um, worn distressed effect so that is great because I quite often don't like when I when I'm matting a photograph in my scrapbooking and the background paper has this perfect cut edges I feel that it would look a lot more interesting if it was distressed so this is what I got this for and I'm very excited to try that now next thing I got Heidi Swap actually I got a few different colors a few different sets I think there's another one which is a blue set and a separate single uh, spray bottle that I got but they haven't arrived yet so this is let's see color shine collection does it say anything about the this the specific collection nope I don't think so so the colors you get in here is peach uh, what's this one the middle one I can't read 
so that's what it is not sure and then the third one is the coral the bottle needs to be turned around for you to read that but that's what it looks like so i'm quite again i have seen these very often used in scrapbooking and um, it looks really interesting when you spray it onto white paper and let it sort of drip or create different things what you can do also is use the stencil use a texture paste which i also got here and then on top you can spray it to make it more interesting so um, as i just mentioned i got also a modeling paste high density so it's a textured paste that you can see on the picture here and it's by the brand Pabio Studio. I have also a gesso from them. I will show you just in a second. It's on the other desk. So this is a huge tub I got. And um, I quite like it. I've been using it a lot. It's quite affordable. I got this one also on Amazon. So that's what it is and then also two more things i finally got my aqua water brush it's just something that you have to have i feel and that's what it looks like so it's great for not only when you are on the go but also when you are at home it's um some of the swatches people do it looks quite nice with this water brush because you have you add water into this container and then once you sort of start swatching it swatching the watercolor you basically press a little bit more to release more water and then you get that lovely graduation and you get the true um you know um look of that particular color going from the density to very washed out so the final thing i got is the martha stewart edge punch it's called um, also referred to as border punch so this is a doily lace i quite like it it's quite heavy and as i think most of the punches are i like this one a lot it probably will be a pain to pierce out all these dots but i will see if they stick or not and so yeah that's my haul from which one was it now that was amazon okay thanks for watching bye bye